also have a split rim on there. So for anybody that's looking to buy a, um, casters, what I would recommend is just to buy the caster and just use a split rim so you don't have to pay for the whole thing. That's terrible. Gosh, that sucks. <clears throat> drive wheel drive tire still good all right so let's pop this back up there we go let's move the battery bring it back down turn it back on i like making these videos because when i first started as a technician there was uh even the guys that i used to work with man they were some of them were punks. Wait, I have it too fast. They uh, they wouldn't help, and they would, you know, you you want to help as much as you can. Technicians. Sorry about that, guys. I had it turned up all the way. Same thing with this one. Man, check out that caster. <laughs> that was completely gone. Texas next week. Doing some work up there. I took a long trip, man. I was up in last the week, last not last week, but the week after the. Anyways, two weeks ago, dang it. I went to uh, Texas, then Denver, then Nebraska. That was a fun trip. It was actually pretty fun. Again, these are these are loose too. So let's tighten that up. It's all the dang uh, humidity. There we go. You can tell the little bubbles came out. that he was using before I'm gonna spray every moving part down here um, they didn't want to come out and help him out anymore that happens a lot man. you see that a lot Get a better adapter. You should probably get a better adapter, sir. Instead of using this Mickey Mouse adapter, I actually do have one, but I have bring this day. <clears throat> I wasn't feeling too good. Please, 
it's hot out here, man. Maybe I'll sweat everything out. So I'm gonna show you guys how I unload the chair. I have a 12 foot ramp, a tri foot ramp. <clears throat> I've used other little Mickey Mouse ramps that are that are terrible, man. And the degrees on it are like. Pfft. Should probably put lube on that one first. <clears throat> PB blaster. is okay let me start getting it off the let me put my tools up now put it in my bag so, take the battery out turn this on let me flip it over I'm gonna lube up the actuators real quick. Tilt actuator. Ooh, that doesn't sound good, does it? Uh oh, that was not good. Something just popped and I don't know what was that. Did you guys hear that pop? He said it's been sitting here for like six months. Not doing anything. But let's lube it up. Oh, wrong one. There we go. I'm even gonna lube up the sliding kit or the sliding boards right here on the side. Oh, there's a freaking brown recluse or something. That's probably good. Bring it back down. Now, a lot of times you just want to come and do what you're supposed to do and go home. Because a lot of times, if you don't do that, you could you start messing with other stuff and you end up breaking it. So that's all I'm going to loop up right now. Then I'm going to bring it back down. And then I'll turn off this video. And we'll be done. All right. So, let's, so I want to show you guys how how I unload these power chairs. A lot of times they'll ask me, do you go forward or reverse? Reverse. Definitely reverse is the best way to go. This is the ramp I have. Bring it out like that. Bring the other side. Grab the joystick. new casters well guys hopefully that helps that helps you guys um 21 minutes forward everything bye